Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel Gemini. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good Gemini. This reading for today, it is a love reading, a love message for the Gemini sign. Let us see what is your love reading Gemini. This reading for today Gemini, this is a twin flame, a soulmate reading. I am channeling today the current energies, the current feelings of the person that is on your mind, okay? So, think about them, visualize them. I'll tap into your energy and let's see what is the current feelings, their intention. This is a twin flame, a soulmate, a person that you regularly think of them you're manifesting them let's see what is let's see if they're uh, connecting with you romantically what's the romantic energy towards you if i will be able to pick up a new love interest i will let you know wow this person is thinking hmm. okay oh see ten of cups okay all right you have the ten of cups Okay, the two of swords okay yeah the five of swords um you could be dealing with a cancer a scorpio a pisces energy you could be dealing with a cancer a scorpio a pisces energy uh this could be a gemini libra aquarius energy it took me a while to pick up the first reading because there's a two of swords and five of swords so the first reading is probably someone you block them or they block you okay um this is very unconventional gemini and the reason why i'm saying that this is unconventional because what they felt towards you gemini is the ten of cups okay um it was the happiest it was unforgettable but they're resisting to continue they have this continue but they're stalking you okay um this could be recently or maybe there was a communication recently between the two of you i think they're scared this person is scared to fall in love this person is scared uh for some sort of commitment yeah tower card i think this person is scared to fall in love they're scared also to be a parent you know they might not be ready to be a parent you know um if you feel like you if you feel gemini that because the empress card and the tower card in here if you feel like during the conversation you were giving them or leading the conversation into marriage commitment kids like if you're asking them What's your view of marriage, commitment, uh, kids, you know, it's possible that they got scared, okay, with the Tower card and the Empress card in here. Um, it's possible that maybe you've been dating for, you know, two months, ten months, or maybe more than that, or since May, like maybe you, you guys are on and off, and somehow with the tower card and the empress card gemini there was a part of you that you would like to take over and to take control to take over and to take control and somehow you would like to yield some result and so you're um you you've asked them those questions like you could be planting the seed about you know talking about um being official uh, talking about marriage if if you feel like you've done that and they stop connecting with you or things went cold after that you know you initiating that conversation maybe we can make it official maybe when are we gonna commit maybe you confronted them with a tower card in here maybe but I'm getting mixed signal but there was something coming from you that you know when you like someone when you love someone you express your feelings and of course you you plant the seed of where are we going you know what's the future between you and me i think you were leading that conversation there and they picked it up 
with the five of swords and they got scared the two and the five okay yeah so they dismiss you um they dismiss you they ghosted you they went cold when it comes to that leading that conversation to something they're not prepared to okay um there's a ten of cups this person they have not forgotten you um this is really like a soulmate because it was like it was like this ten of cups it's something unforgettable okay you were very unforgettable uh the chemistry is amazing they just resist because they're scared of control they're scared of being caged or i don't know there was a conversation that that has put them into i'm i am stepping back okay it's like they chicken out okay gemini that's the vibe that i'm picking up with this person i don't know maybe this person is they're not in the mood to talk about that yeah for like i'm really getting a very strong vibe that this person they have to stop it because whatever you were ins insinuating they were not prepared they're just like let's just have fun let's date let's kiss let's make up you know but to deal about i don't know maybe the future they're not prepared with that and they don't want to hurt you so they kind of ghosted you or exit the connection without saying goodbye there was something improper that they did especially the five of swords here yeah like they stop texting you back or they slow down texting you calling you back they slow slow down and then eight of wands then it went to zero from four to eight let's look at this person um this person is thinking of you there's a nine and a ten it was it was kind of deliberate to put things on hold because they were happy with you um nine of cups i feel like this is where they're heading is that i wish to be disconnected gemini so i can figure things out you are still part of my unforgettable experience in my life but i just want to figure out what's next i don't want to disappoint you like they want to stop it before you fall in love or they want to stop it before it makes you frustrated okay um yeah the nine of cups maybe this is maybe maybe this is now maybe this is last july uh the judgment card okay the king of wands now it could be july because i'm seeing because the nine of cups this is a very wish fulfillment so your person you know if because this is this looks like a family so your person is wanting to have like kids and family and marriage but they see that happening not too soon so it's something that if you talk about that in if you put that in the equation they will kind of run away i don't know maybe this person maybe they have some family history about you know i don't it puts a pressure to them because it's a king of wands but they they do want to be in a marriage again getting married having kids or blended family they're open to that i don't know why the spirit today is explaining to you that without you asking them without you planting that in the conversation that is where you want to go this is a very passionate lover a passionate person this is a passionate person this is a passionate lover passionate person they really want to experience everything in life but they just don't want to be controlled okay so i still feel like this person is just you know a, like soaking with what took place between the two of you but they're open to that okay you might have scared them i'm sorry i just have to deliver the feeling or maybe there was a pressure about that conversation i don't think this person is mad or angry with you because they're still thinking of a ten of cups with you okay maybe they made they made you disappointed that was disappointing you know tower card because this is just getting hot in here the tower card and they disappear but they still look at you as someone who they desire you look at that you know like somehow there is an advantage when you were kind of 
luring the conversation to marriage official and this and that you have every right to do that it so happened that it's not timely for them to listen it's like it's pinching their ears you know like it's it's a pain like to it's a pressure to hear that from them but now they know so this person is aware that you are a gemini who wants commitment official marriage kids and stuff they now they know and that is why this person is coming into in sync that if i connect with you or if i return with you gemini i have to be able to offer you what you did what your hearts desire as a lover okay so somehow there is an advantage of you saying that it might come off wrong timing on their part but with the king of wands in here now they know what you want and if they come back they have to you know align themselves to what you want okay so there is an advantage okay especially if this is because the tower card the empress card in here especially gemini if you really put it out there if you really had a conversation look we've been dating like what's going on you know what is your views of marriage and kids and you know we've been dating on and off what's really is if you did con confront this person good on you you might have scared them or i don't know maybe why they acted they chicken out but at least you get to the point and i believe that if we want something we gotta put it there some people doesn't know how to respond some people get overwhelmed but at least they know what you want so don't regret it okay um if, if people want that they will compromise to our needs okay because i feel like right now this person's king of wands they're thinking of what you said commitment marriage being official exclusivity and security you know you're worth it that's why you're asking the following okay uh you're asking the following because you're worth it so right now this person is like thinking if i return to you i should be able to offer that if i don't return to you if i'm not returning yet because i'm still figuring out whether i can offer that and that's better if they're not gonna be marrying you or giving exclusive relationship then don't be with them you know some there's something in here that you put it in your words or in action that i want commitment i want marriage i want relationship let's let's end this on and off let's be exclusive let's not date let's just be together maybe this this has been this has been going on for quite some time now i don't judge you i am a reader who delivers unattach see nine of wands the seven the devil oh they want me to keep the devil card in reverse right now i could feel in terms of your romance in i'm checking in with you i'm checking in with your um energy you have options you have beautiful options i would say for some of you you have other options in your life that is also good and beautiful but nine of wands your heart wants what it wants and somehow it's connected to the soulmate yeah this is a soulmate it's unshakable um only time can tell but i still see a new person coming into your life who would probably give you the same experience and feelings that you felt towards the soulmate that might change everything you know especially around the eclipse but um have an open mind the only red flag in here in terms of your energy checked in is that have an open mind open heart like let others come into your life let others connect with you because that's the only way you will realize that aha uh -huh, someone is someone could replace you okay because you're quite guarded nine of wands in here have an open mind open heart because there's so much like there's so much efficiency for you look at that seven of cups the devil card so much fish in the sea um go fishing gemini jupiter is in you remember that gemini this is beautiful thank you gemini for supporting the channel okay thank you so much guys for being here this is your soulmate twin film twin flame reading this is a person unshakable <laughs> gemini love 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 i'll see you soon you take care click the bell okay and click the subscribe button bye gemini